Project Management Insights, providing project managers with professional development in the interpersonal skills areas of leadership, team building and communication. Hi, welcome to this week's episode of Project Management Insights. How have you been going giving your team members praise, appreciating, telling them you appreciate what you're doing, what they're doing and the outcomes or deliveries that they have been making for you in your project? And would you know if that praise, that acknowledgement, the appreciation that you're giving them is landing with them? You know what I mean? Have you ever been in that space where someone said to you, thanks, or I appreciate what you do, and have you noticed that what happens inside you is it feels hollow? It doesn't feel as if that praise is actually landing, as I call it. It's like you don't feel it inside you. It feels false or it's not delivered in the way that you want it to be delivered. And so what are you noticing when you deliver praise or show your appreciation to your team members? Are you noticing that they brush it off as if you didn't say it? Do they make a snide remark or a comment that shows that they, they're having a reaction to it, like, what do you mean, you know, it's not worth what you've said or that's not really appreciating me or it's not enough. So it's something to become really aware of in terms of all praise is not equal. Praise or showing your appreciation only works when the other person gets what they need. They might need you to put it in writing, as an example, or they might need you to speak it out loud in a team meeting in front of others. And what doesn't work for them is when you tell them individually. I know it sounds crazy, and yet it's what happens if you really notice what's going on with these team members when you say thank you. So it's about getting to know the person and getting to understand what sort of acknowledgement, appreciation or praise works for them. And I'm not talking about you needing to be some psychologist here. That's not what it's about. It's just about taking that time to watch those little messages that come back from the other person when you interact with them. This is about turning on your own internal antenna and noticing. Because if you do that, what you'll find is that you become a lot better, smarter, how whatever you would like to, however you would like to call it, you'll get a lot smarter at being able to pick up when something doesn't work for the other person. And when it comes down to it, if you deliver a thank you and they don't take it in, well, you are wasting your breath, aren't you? You may as well not have said what you said. And yes, this gets down to the nitty gritty of individual personalities. And guess what? You're working with a team of individuals. You are working with individuals who have their own way of thinking about things, their own way of doing things, their own way of needing certain things to be, their own list of wants. So <laughs> welcome to the world. And I think the problem we have sometimes is that we tend to put everybody in the one basket and believe that delivering one message one way works for everybody, when ultimately the truth is that it doesn't. It doesn't work because we are individuals. We have our own way of, I suppose, feeling or sensing for ourselves that we are 
wanted, we are cared for, we are acknowledged, we are appreciated, we are loved, in inverted commas, and even in the workplace, this is true. And so be mindful of how you're delivering the praise and whether it seems to be being taken in by those team members that you deliver the praise to or whether there's something else going on. And maybe it's a conversation you can have with them. Again, this is the best way to find out what they want or what they they need, what they think they need. If they think they need you to speak out loud in front of a team meeting to appreciate what they've done, well, hey, isn't it easy rather than you delivering message after message after message every other way to simply be able to go into the team meeting and say, today I want to give thanks to Joe and Tom and Sarah and Greg and Andrew for all of their fabulous work. And guess what? They're, they're going to take it in. You're going to see the smiles on their faces. You're going to see that it's really worked for them. How simple. So make your life simpler and start to notice what's happening when you deliver praise to your team members and whether it's landing or not. And if you haven't been delivering praise in the form of appreciation and acknowledgement of the work that's going on, then come on, get on with it. Take the time to do that and start today. It's really, really valuable. You will begin to notice a shift in the output of what you receive from your team members if you do this one simple thing. Till next time. Thank you for listening to this Project Management Insights podcast. Be sure to visit projectmanagementinsight.com and sign up for our monthly newsletter or to receive updates on upcoming training. Thank you.